Okay, folks, welcome to another how to video on my YouTube channel, Home Edition. In this video, I'm going to show you a very suspicious email message. And you can get these from people who are basically trying to acquire your private information somehow. So let's look at this one right here. The person who sent it is Facebook accounts. Subject is account blocked. And right here, I have my preview pane in Outlook 2007 and it has my email address but look right here it says facebook accounts but look at the email address do you see facebook anywhere in there exactly so that's your first sign if the email address actually doesn't have the actual domain name of whoever is supposedly sending you these messages if it doesn't have the actual name in there then that's your first clue that this could be a scam and another thing to look at is hover over one of these links see right here it says http www.facebook slash home php so that's the actual url that you should go to if you clicked on that correct but if you hover over the url you will notice that it's actually going somewhere else and look wwgss-agent so this is your second clue that this is a phishing email and you should basically just delete this okay do not even click their unsubscribe button because look again that's just gonna send you somewhere and, and who knows what can happen maybe you could even get a virus of some type so whenever you get an email and you have suspicion about it like you you actually do think that it's fraudulent look for the classic signs you know look at the domain name that it came from this thing says Facebook accounts and again the actual email address if I double click it is paramarkinc.com obviously that's not Facebook so I mean right off the bat just seeing that I will know that it's fake but obviously you can look at the other clues if you click on any of these well don't click on the links but if you hover over them you'll see that they're actually spoofing it they're, they're saying one thing that it's gonna go to facebook.com slash home but in actuality, it's actually going to take you somewhere else. You know, that's one way uh, you could uh, figure out if you're looking at fake emails and, you know, they come from eBay, they come from PayPal, Facebook, Twitter. I mean, there's, there's a whole bunch of companies trying to spoof legitimate companies like Amazon and they're trying to get your information like your username and password so they could, uh, you know, access your contact information and start sending spam to all your friends and stuff so keep a lookout for uh, emails like that another thing you can do if you're uh, even more curious for instance and now look if I right click and then I click message options and right here where it says internet headers you have a lot more information okay another thing you could do is forward this entire email to this address spam at uce.gov and what I also like to do is let me go back to the original message okay I'm gonna click message options and I'm gonna copy the internet headers so I'll just click in there and then hit control A control C okay that way they have a lot more uh, detail about the who this came from okay so let me click send and there you go so that's how you take care of those annoying emails and that's how you could kind of investigate these emails for yourself like is this a phishing scam you know is this really from Facebook or PayPal so I really hope that helps you a little bit and at least it might help you sort your inbox better and uh, now you know that if you hover over links and it could be on a website as well like let me go to a website real quick I mean you can hover over a link like this one for instance and in the lower left hand corner watch right here when I hover over a link you see it says the domain name of which we are on because we're on simplyeditions.com so when you're hovering over links usually your browser no matter what browser you're using tells you the URL you're going to go to once you click on a link 
So keep that in mind. You know, if you're not sure about a certain website or advertisement on the internet, just hover over the link and see where it's going to take you. If you like videos like this, go ahead and subscribe to my channel, youtube.com slash home edition, because I have lots of great videos that can really help you.